Hello. What are you doing here? Someone stole something from the village. And apparently we're going back. Madan Sari is not that far. I don't know what that is. I should probably pay attention. It's probably from where he's from or something silly like that. Um, but I don't pay attention, so fuck it. Let's see here. So we need to go back to the village. First, I need to um, waste a phoenix down on Doc here, and then Ether on Bashful and heal everyone. I'm going to use Cure a couple times here. There we go. Okay, we're good now. Uh, we still don't have any mana for most people. We should be good. And we got some new items, so let me check that real quick. Didn't get anything there. Nothing there. Come on now. Where is it at? Burgundy, and there it is. And there's my phone. Ability up. We lose spirit. Two spirit for two def no, three defense and one strength. So that's actually pretty good. And I can get ability up on Sleepy, finally. Um, and then I need to check the phone real quick, so I'll be right back. And we're back, hopefully with less phone call interruptions as I move my chair. Uh, my rolly chair, my noisy rolly chair. At least it's not squeaky. Um, squeaky rolly chair would be terrible. Uh, I'm gonna do about another 20-ish minutes. That should give me an hour set, which would be good uh, for quite a while. That's three videos right there, so and I totally ran in the wrong fucking direction. But yeah, that's uh, that's three videos, so that's about three days at my given upload rate, and oh my fucking god. Plus all the Portal 2 stuff, and then um, still no black and white because I still hadn't gotten it to stop crashing, which is annoying, to be honest. I really wish it would stop doing that. Um, and other news, though, the Steam sale's over, so eh. Been playing a couple games there, here and there on that. Might do a... Uh, potential playthrough on something I purchased from that. Not gonna say what, because I don't want people jumping on it like I said I would do a playthrough. Uh, because there's no guarantee of what I will do, to be honest. Um, I might say I'll do something, but then I might not actually have time to do it. So, like, black and white, uh, I got five episodes out, and then it starts fucking crashing constantly, so... You know, just don't take everything I say as a guarantee. I will try to eventually, at some point, get black and white done just not looking too good right now, and I wish they would stop countering. I should probably just use magic anyway. I'll be back on this fight saver. That fight went terribly. Um, let's see here. There we go. Uh, so yeah, then you got all the Supreme Commander crap I've got to eventually go back and do. Um, which is actually where the majority of my viewer base is, is in the, the real-time strategy stuff. Uh, so that's kind of important to get back to, and I'm actually going to save here. So I hadn't saved in a while, so I'm going to be back when I'm done saved. Okie dokie. And back to the um, village thing here, whatever this is. Oh, that Madansari. That's what that is, and that's why they said it's not very far. Because it's not, as it turns out. I'm home, maybe. Hello. There's all the mules. Come now, talk later. Okay. So something has important has been stolen from the urgency in the uh, the Moogles there. So we're just gonna follow and do our best not to be useful in any way, shape, or form. That's probably not over here, but I'm gonna check here first anyway. Hello, anything, anyone, anywhere? Snow White still back here cooking. Hello. Okay, so apparently there is a thing down here that I didn't know about. There's also a chest. Gone! It's gone! So someone stole the stone, apparently.
Hmm. Hiccup. Why? What? Who's hiccuping? Seriously, who is hiccuping? Seriously, who is hiccuping? Is it her that's hiccuping? Why would she be hiccuping? Okay, can I get that chest yet? Please, maybe? <laughs> I'm a man, I don't cry. something happened. I heard a scream. The girl from Fossil Rue. Hmm. I would like that chest first, please, please. Thank oh, damn it. Chest. Geef chest. Geef. Can I even get that chest? Is that possible? I can. And that's a survival fest. That's relatively disappointing. Get all the loot I'm stealing. Yes. I'm such a good role model. Trust me. Uh, we should be all set up for a potential fight with that person again. I believe we uh, encounter a new character soon here, actually. So that should be good. Let me make sure my abilities are set up. I don't think it's a beast, so we don't need that. Uh, prevents back attacks. Don't need that right now. High tide might be good. That. Let's throw auto potion on. And should I use mug? Yeah, we may as well. I think it's a man anyway. I'm not quite sure to be honest. Hopefully it's a man, otherwise I just screwed that up horribly. Hello, Moogles. They're all freaking out. Um, peek inside. I guess. I don't need them to heal me, so... This is no way to treat a lady. Until he gets here. Who is she talking about? Hmm. And we finally got those treasure chests over there. Exploda and Elixir. What the hell is Exploda? Uh, hold on one second. I'd like to figure out what this Exploda is. I'd also like to arrange my crap. There we go. Is that a weapon? Oh my god, it's a weapon for me. It's exciting. <laughs> it's it's worse. I did a sacrifice though. Hmm. It also causes trouble. Hmm. What does? Where did what is it called? Sacrifice. Where the hell is that at? Ability sacrifice. It's not even in here. Well, I'm not going to use that. It's worse right now, and I don't want to have lower attack for something to learn. Um, just in case, I'm going to use healers. Okay, HP and MP, that's good. Where is Mog? Hello. Mog does not like this plan so far.
You should just say that casually. Okay, let's go. Been screwing around long enough. Hello. Don't you think it'd be tiring to to uh, hold her out like that for so long? <laughs> nope. I am a good knight, thank you. So... Nope. She's on to us. Curses. As he adjusts his pants. And his hat, constantly. Oop. It's the other one. Just stand. That's all you need to know. She's behind you. Hmm. His name is Red. And yep, if you recall, or if I did mention that, I hope I did, I know I mentioned it in one recording where the sound was all fucked up and then I had to do it again. I don't remember if I did it at that time, though. He has wanted posters all over Trino, now that I've rambled for a little bit there. Hmm. He doesn't work with hostage-taking scumbags. And apparently there's a bounty on him, and he's a bounty hunter. That seems kind of contradictory. And now he wants to fight us. Okay. <laughs> this isn't one of those ways to impress her. This is a 1v1 fight, if I recall, which is why I was worried about a uh, sleepy setup. Now, I do believe he counts as a man, so the man uh, killer bonus will count here. I don't know if you can steal from him, but we're gonna damn well try. This is also why I put auto potion on, it'll keep me from having to heal nearly as much. No, it causes trouble, don't need steal. Scarlet hair, where the hell? Stolen ether. And thanks to Mug, I actually deal damage to him. I'm not sure what he's doing, though. Um, good steal. And he's doing something. I don't know what he's doing, though. He's attacking. He's awfully slow with his attacking. I thought this was going to be a far more difficult fight, but I guess... Due to the current setup, it just shouldn't be too hard. Oh, I dodged too, that's weird. Really and we can trance relatively quickly due to uh, whatever that skill is that I put on. Every attack fills up a nice chunk of the uh, trance bar there, so. And he's gonna jump around again and then hit me in the face. Not sure what the purpose of jumping around is, and we got some poison knuckles, which are actually weapons for him. Which is kind of a spoiler in the fact that we can, in fact, use him. And I've only lost, like, 20 health so far, so... Doesn't have anything. Alright, we can start beating the crap out of him, which is just in time, because we have a trance now. So he's gonna die really quickly. Uh, all enemies... To the enemy. Well, that's half the MP, so I'm gonna use that just for the sake of conserving MP. Not using 48 per attack because that's ridiculous. 
Plus, I don't think we've seen this one yet. We might have, though, I don't know. Nope, oh, we haven't, I'm pretty sure. It's like a tornado of data. Yeah, it does basically the same damage as the other one for half the MP. Which is good, because he's gonna die really quickly with uh, 5,000 damage per attack here. Hopefully this doesn't miss because he's way over there. That would piss me off. Nope. And he's dead in two attacks. That was easy. Plus two mugs, which were like 400 damage or something. And nine more AP for me, but I didn't actually have anything to learn. So that was a huge waste of AP there. Whatever. You're damn right you lost. We're just here for the pendant, man. We're not here to kill you. Thank you. He really wants to die. Nope. We just wanted the pendant. I like that quote right there, the sly eagle doesn't kill at whim. And he leaves without saying another word after that quote. It's probably some quote that the, the, the uh, Red recognized, so he didn't say anything, he just left. Um, not particularly sure, to be honest, I could probably look up that, as many other things that I should look up. It's also very cold, so I apologize for any background shivering noise you might hear. Uh, we don't we don't run the heat around here. We don't got that kind of money to run, be running dumb heater, dumb heaters. All right. Um, now that that's over, I would like to save and end this set. And luckily, there's a Moogle right here. Um, save. I wonder if Happy's leaving. God damn it. Moogle's never useful. Just stands there and does nothing. Is she over here or is she in the entrance? Do I save here? Um, I can rest. Don't really need to, though. So I'll pass on that. Hello! There's a Moogle here, so she's probably in this room. Yep. She's just sitting there staring at it, apparently. Until my 16th birthday. Um, I don't think it matters which one you pick, but I'll just say yes. Forget what your grandfather said. See, doesn't matter what I say, she already made up her mind. Um, and actually, she does have wings on her back, you can see them right there, they're just not nearly as big um, as when she's in trance. She also has like cat ears or something. I don't I don't know what's going on with her. You okay there, Doc? He has a point. There's also that creepy moogle sitting there in the, the top right looking through the hole. Creepy moogle's creepy. And we received the memory earring. Really, he's just kind of sitting in the window. That kind of gives it away. <laughs> She's furious. how best, best friends are. They get furious at each other and then continue like nothing happened. And she has